Hello, I'm George Kahomoku, came all the way from Maui, Hawaii, originally born and raised in South Kona, Kealia. Rochester Fest, it's been going for a week. Like, we've been here a couple of days, but we've been doing all the schools and stuff like that yesterday. Everybody say Hanaho. Hanaho. Which means one more time, okay? You got to get this here together. The thing is, we, we try to, um, you know, include kids in, and teach them a little bit of our culture, a little bit of our language, you know, about our values, the values of Aloha, sharing a lot, the values of compassion, the values of Kokoa working together, also the values of uh, many hands working together. Laulima. So these are concepts that are wine concepts, but they're, they're universal concepts you know, throughout the world. And I've been using these concepts for years to teach uh, at risk kids on Maui. I, you know, I taught for 18 years for community schools. I was a school principal then. I taught 20 years at Lion Oluna for many years. And I'm still teaching, you know. So we're really blessed that we can be here. And now I get this is the first time I met his son, Chuck Jr. <laughs> the thing is, what, what's great about us is we have a sense of connection from Hawaii to Rochester, thanks to his dad. Dad came from Maui and he played music and he did visit us and stuff like that. In fact, a couple of times we got together and shared some food and stuff like that. But I didn't realize that he was, and he brought us over several times to, to Rochester, but I didn't realize that he was the mayor and all that. <laughs> you know, he's the big whip over here, you know what I mean? I up over here from, from Maui, you know? Um, well, mom and dad met in Iowa going to school. Oh. And through things, he was asked to, he took a position at the YMCA, which is behind us. Wow. Which is historically there, has a building still. And from there, the city, um, he, he's just thankful. And he, he brought what? He brought the aloha. He brought the aloha thing, yeah. to us as a family, but we, we couldn't afford to go to Hawaii very often, so he just taught us things that what we just thought was normal because it's at home. Yeah. But the connections of community started the neighborhood block party. Yeah, family. Family. Yeah. Um, just everybody sure. knowing everybody, caring for everybody. And then he, when he was asked to run for mayor, uh, he came home. It was always a family decision, and of course, mom had the last say. See? But it was with my sister and I, and of course, we were young, and we were like, "Yeah, we didn't know what we were saying." Um, and he won, and hard work, and community, and just and the family, the sense of family, family, yeah. and just taking responsibility for one another. And he just, I think, he just fed that to all of us, right. and the the people here fed him in return and just humble thanks and he was I've just heard so many stories I'm kind of speechless um, that uh, that's why you're here yeah, I'm and it, you know, an and honor I, to have you here yeah too. and it's an honor for us to come you know play here for, for your dad you know and uh, I just saw it some of these circumstances you know what I mean that we had to play for, for his uh, celebration of life but what better way you know and, and to meet you it's really, it's really been on that. Yeah, yeah. I can't
wake up with clouds of fire behind.